Disturbing images tonight of an elderly man severely bruised. And according to this man's daughter, they came from an employee at an area nursing home. And tonight, McKeesport Police tell Channel 11 they are investigating. Our Michelle Newell joins us live with the daughter's concerns. Michelle? Lisa, there are three big takeaways to this story. The first you mentioned is police are investigating this alleged incident. The second is that the daughter says she was told the employee who was involved in this incident has been suspended. And finally, the nursing home where this allegedly happened, well, they haven't responded to my request for a comment just yet. These pictures are hard to look at. An 82-year-old man all banged up and bruised. And McKeesport police are investigating this. He had marks on his head, arms, and legs. Andrea Leach can't believe this happened to her father. She made sure to snap pictures of every single bruise. You put, you know, your loved one in the nursing home, expecting them to get treated with proper care and... It didn't happen that way. Leach's father stays at Riverside Care Center in McKeesport, but care isn't what Leach says her father got on New Year's Day. He looked at me and said, Andy, a young guy beat me up. Meanwhile, my dad has dementia, but he recalled that. Leach says an aide saw her dad in the hallway and tried to assist him to the restroom, but he said he didn't want to go. Once her father was back inside his room, they told me that um, they heard a big commotion in my dad's room. Leach says other nurses found her father all bruised up. Her father had to be taken to the hospital and police were called. Channel 11 contacted the facility twice. We were told the supervisor wasn't in. They didn't tell me until like the next day that he was suspended pending investigation. Again, we again we reached out to that nursing facility and we're told the supervisor wasn't in. We will keep you updated on this story. Reporting live, I'm Michelle Newell for Channel 11 News.